Cardio family! Man, it's a lot of stuff going on in America, man. Like always, man. It's just like Don when is gonna end. Watching. Don Lemon. Welcome to the news with Cardio. Y'all know Don Lemon will tell you? Who? Yeah, Don Lemon. Yeah, what the hell is that? Is that some guy? Mm -hmm. So he's just like a politician or something? He's nah, a, he's a, a, a reporter. A, yeah, he's an anchor, news analyst. Anchor. He's, 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 he's at LSU. Yeah, he went to LSU. He went to Brock. Is this our first time doing CNN? What? Yeah, yeah. Ah, which one is CNN? CNN? Which one they are? That's the, 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 the them and MSNBC. Fox, Fox is, is right. Fox is yeah. extreme. Fox right. just got yeah, sued. Yeah, I think I think CNN is the in the middle. Trump, though. Though. Why'd they get sued? Uh, they got they had to admit to lying. Fox News they, they admitted they lost uh, to by the Dominion Company. Mm -hmm. They're a voting company on the opposite oh. of. Oh. Yeah, they uh, said some bad thing because you know and uh, they admitted to lying about it and they got sued for seven hundred million dollars. They settled on that. What? They said yeah, it was it was it was pretty bad. That is insane. When did that happen? Just recently? Like, yeah, last couple days. What's this guy named, uh... Vivek? Vivek? Uh, Ramsormi. Ramsormi. Demolishes Don Lemon? Shaw boy. <laughs> Candidate Vivek Vivek Ramsormi. On his own show. A name like that, you're not gonna win the GOP, brother. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right. Let's go ahead and get to it. <laughs> Oh man! Let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's go. I don't know what GOP. Yeah, 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 yeah. You, you might have hit that hammer on the head. What's GOP? It's a fact. It's not that it's insulting. There Wait, are four insult reasons that for the civil war. He's one of the best reasons. It's not that it's insulting. There are four insult reasons that. The With due respect, I find I find your explanation reductive and actually insulting, including to black Americans, to say that black people today, compared to 1964, 1865, haven't made progress in part because of the freedoms we secured. Don Lemon wasn't ready. Yeah, he's ready. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's he's ready for Republicans. I ain't doing the legal off the page video. I'm gonna tell you, we're gonna subscribe to the channel, hit the bell so you get notifications anytime I go live or make a video. Make sure you still subscribe to this channel, like this video, comment on this video, share this video. Let's get into this. Ladies and gentlemen, Vivek Ramaswamy, I honestly believe if Donald Trump wasn't as much of a rock star as he is, Vivek Ramaswamy would be my number one choice for president. Whoa! I honestly believe oh, wow. that Vivek can be the president over Ron DeSantis. And, and I, I normally don't talk like this, but man, I've been listening to this man, and this dude makes so much sense, so intelligent, a businessman that have generated wealth, and, and he has my respect. And so if Donald Trump wasn't gonna run, I, I almost would put him ahead of Ron DeSantis, to be quite honest. But let me tell you about this. You gotta watch this exchange between Vivek and Don Lemon. I, I just love it when people are unashamed to tell the truth and not worry about the color of your skin or who can say what about what people. Just focus on facts. And I have never seen anybody other than Sheriff, I forget his name, the sheriff that, that went on Don Lemon and literally was like this, face to face with Don Lemon and, and, and charged him up on the show. No, um, I see that. But no, I've God. never seen anybody challenge Don Lemon and have a strong conviction of facts than Vivek Ramaswamy. So let me go uh, and play the That's clip so y'all need to watch this. I'm very interested. This is, the, this is, this is yeah. epic. Yeah. I'm sorry what I said about your name. back up like, get Steve on the right. Politics get real, boy, hit him with the direction. The very policies that we implemented in this country in the name of helping black Americans have actually been disastrous for mm. black Americans Facts. and all Americans. And I think so that that's something that we need to wake up to. In 1865, you're talking about the black codes, right? That's right. Passed, enacted to make the crime for a black person to carry a gun exactly. in the South. But you're equating that to the current president? You're referring to economic change? What are you saying? Well, I, I was referring to Joe Biden's, I think, ill-chosen expression to say they're the party that wants to put you back into chains. What I'm actually saying is that if you look at the policies you of the modern Democratic Party. Democrat Democrats. Absolutely. So what I'm saying is that actually it's policies like that of Lyndon Johnson and Joe Biden that are actually holding black Lyndon Americans Johnson's back. the war on poverty? Yes, and in particular, his great society where he actually created incentives in the family, where if you're a family, you could actually get more money by not having the father in the home. What? Guess what you get? You get what you... Yes. Facts! I, we gonna continue. Wow. Facts! Guys. On facts! Yeah, and awesome. then on top of that is another yeah, fact that was on another fact. I swear. They can't handle this! That they don't crazy. hear facts! I, I pray to God people are listening. Paid for. I think it's been really bad for the black community. I think it's really bad for all Americans. What do you have anything on this before I move on to China? I don't see what one has to do with the other, but go on. I took up a lot of course you don't. Oh, it's fine. <laughs> I don't really see what one has to do with the other, especially consider and using the Civil War to talk about black Americans. That war was not fought for black people to have guns. That's 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 not that war was fought for black people to have freedoms in this country. Yeah. Actually, that's why the Civil War was fought. Okay. And the sad that part wasn't about fought it. for for black people to have guns. I think. 
Actually, you know, a funny fact is black people did not get to enjoy the other freedoms until their Second Amendment rights were secured. And I think that that's one of the lessons that we learned. aren't allowed to enjoy the freedoms. I disagree with you country. on that, Don. I disagree with you. And I think you're doing a disservice well, to our country okay. by failing to recognize when the you, fact that we have you are in black law skin, and you. Oh no, no, no! no, 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 no. He was black. We, I got to clear it back. Because, because, because black you are. see, Vivek was giving facts. You got to be a Looney Tune <laughs> to think you. that the civil right, the civil war wasn't fought so all people can have freedom. And when you have your freedoms, you have the freedom to keep and bear arms that go together. But see, see, he can't argue on the merit. He can't argue on what Vivek was saying because he know he ain't got he, the facts in on his side. So look at the direction that he went. Well, Service to our country. Okay. By failing to recognize when the you, fact that we have you are in black law skin law. and you live in this country, then you can disagree with me. But we're not. You mentioned it. There I disagree. Are three different shades Jonathan, of melanin. We have to be able here. to talk about these issues in the open, regardless of the color of our skin. Black Americans today, to say that compare that to 1865 and 1964, I think you compare absolutely. Absolutely. 1865 and 1964 is actually. I think it's insulting to black people. It's insulting to me as an African American. I don't want to sit here and argue with you. I like Vivek, man. Did he really just say that he was right because he's black? Yes. That's insane. Well, you can tell me when you live on a block. Man, all the time, bro. Don't let him act like he didn't go on CNN and say that black people made the hood dirty because they throw trash on the ground. He did. That was him. Yes. Wait, it's it's. Oh, that's not him. I'm thinking about the other guy. Bro, the Daily Show. Is that him? No, no, that's two different networks. That's Trevor. Oh, I'm thinking about the other black guy. Trevor Noah. Okay. Yeah. I never seen this guy. Trevor Noah's like British or something. Yeah. What? It's crazy. Wow. He's not a hundred percent. Yeah. So he's he's a Comedian, huh? Yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. okay, okay. All right. He's a smart guy. Back at one time. Or is I think it's insulting to black people. It's insulting to me as an African American. I don't want to sit there and argue with you because it's infuriating for you to put that to put those things together. It's not right. Your telling of history is wrong. Wow. Your, what, what, your what part of the history was wrong? What, 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 what part of the history, history was wrong? That the Civil War was fought. You're making people think that the Civil War was fought for black people, only for black people to get guns and for black people to the have... The Civil War was fought for black people in this country to get freedoms. A noble mission. And I think that it, even yes, after right, even after we succeeded, to, to we had to actually secure those freedoms. To reduce it, it in a speech at the NRA to say you're making people think, or you're trying to say that black people uh, to get guns, that was, that, that was the reason that you're there at the NRA. That was the reason for for, uh, for the Civil War. It I is think a that's fact. Reductive, it's not and reductive. I think it's done. insulting. There are a whole plethora of reasons that I, for look, the Civil with War. With due respect, I find, I find your explanation reductive and actually insulting, including to black Americans, to say that black people today, compared to 1964, 1865, haven't made progress in part because of the freedoms we secured. And the Second Amendment was black part of the Second Amendment. Please, freedom. I cannot keep a thought if you guys are talking to me in my ear. So uh, hang on once. Oh no no no! You, I, I, I'm it's, getting it's confused and I'm getting tight. bamboozled. Get a little hot by, in there. I, I say feeling the bamboozled by all of these facts. Facts. They can't talk in your ear. Facts. You can't talk to the people the in your ear. Because homeboy <laughs> light you up like a candlestick. Light Boy, you, you up with like facts. <laughs> they cannot stand to think that black people could be liberated with truth and facts. But see, the black man on the panel has to be the one that try to keep black people down and tell you that the civil civil war wasn't fought for your freedoms because they need you to hate the country. Just listen to the man spitting facts. Mm. So to say that that black people say, say what you said again. Black people <laughs> say what you said again. You <laughs> heard what he said, bro. <laughs> their freedoms after the Civil War is a historical fact, Don. Just study it. Only after their Second Amendment rights were secured. They were not secured their freedoms after the Civil War. That is not you. You are discounting uh, uh, Reconstruction. You're discounting a whole host of things that happened after the Civil War when it comes to African Americans, including so the whole reason that, that the Civil Rights Movement happened is because black people did not. Secure Secure their freedoms after the Civil War, and that things turned around. People were tried to change the freedoms that were supposed to. And you know how they the got it? War. They got their Second Amendment rights, right. and okay. they actually got the NRA played a big role in that. But today, down the, the line, NRA did the, not play a big role. Absolutely, they black Americans how to use firearms. That's a lie. That's at, not. The NRA actually, did not play a big role. This is just historical fact. It's not historical fact. The part that I find is you say it's historical fact. The part that I find insulting is when you say today black Americans don't have those rights after we have gone through civil rights revolution. You are sitting here telling an African American about the rights 
rights and what you find insulting about the the, the way I live, the skin I live in every... Man, I'm black and, and Vivek is telling the truth, bro. Quit pulling that card. I'm black and like, I know he telling the truth. He's black again? Today. Here's what you and I have the freedom that black on. and white that black people don't have in this he, country he, and that black people do have. Well, well, here's where you and I have a different point of view. I think we should be able to express our views regardless of the color of our skin. We should no. have this debate I'm not saying you without me regarding views, you as a black man, insulting that but you're me sitting regarding here, you as a fellow citizen. That you're That's sitting what I think here, whatever ethnicity you are, explaining to me whatever ethnicity I'm, I'm what like insulting. to be black. That's whatever it. ethnicity I'm, I'll Sorry. tell you what I am. I'm an Indian American. I'm proud of it. But I think we should have this debate. Black, white, doesn't matter. I think we should have this on debate on the content of the idea. We should do it in an honest way and in a fair way. And what you're doing is not an honest and fair way. Man, be real, man. I like with due respect. I don't think we need that conversation. Thank you. Conversation. Thank you. Oh, oh they got like like Now this might yeah, be she a was the whole time. time. That's that the, was she, a, she she knows she ain't finna put her foot out. This might be actually but the Don worst. But Don Lemon cannot me. allow bro a man can, can, of intelligence. Can anyone bring up a point that bro made? Who? <laughs> oh. I think. Mean, bro, bro, bro. Oh, he, he was saying. He, he, he was saying. He was saying. Like, with him, he did, bro, he was saying that like he was trying to point out. Oh well, after all these things happened after the Civil War, but Ramaswamy was like, black people got freedom in the Civil War and then fought to get equal. Now today we're equal. He was saying, well, it didn't happen after the Civil War. Literally, you're just breaking yeah. down what he said, but he yeah, literally just said what you black said. Black people ain't made no progress. This credits all the people who fought to get progress. Yeah. People have literally died for okay. us to get yeah, progress. A, Multiple people have died. Now, what you uh, say, the NRA? What did that That's mean? the National Rifleman's Association. What is that about? So, so he was saying like, when they gave black people the right to have guns, that was a big step. Yeah, he said, he said they, they, right. they, okay. they, they yeah. supported black Think people's about that. Yeah, that's big. He was saying, no, they didn't. If you how did they not dislike black people, you don't want them to have guns. Yeah. Because they make it up them things. <laughs> yeah. no, no, he said, no, 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 no. He said, he said the NRA played a part no, no, in black no, no. people earning no, no, no. their no, no, no. second amendment right to own guns because yeah. President Lyndon B. Johnson made it illegal for black people in the South to own guns. So he said the NRA played a part in black people earning their second amendment right to own guns. And he was basically saying that after the Civil War, when black people were, uh, fought to earn freedoms, they also fought to get on the same playing field as everyone else, and now today, that they're on the same playing field. And he was saying, no, they're not. Uh, 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 I can't believe uh, Don just got this black like that. Like that. That was pretty bad. Yeah, Don tweeted out bad. I made Louisiana look bad, Don. Yeah, bro, we had a debate here. Yeah, I mean, you can't. He said, well, when you get black, we can. Yeah, you can't You can't do that. Whatever race you are. And that was actually the most When he said that, when he started pulling the black card, his whole argument, all his emotional. Yeah, that's insane. Bro, why you can't just like, get this like, out of my ear. Like, whatever race you are. Yeah. Why you can't just say, like, bro was making good points. Yeah. Like, what did he, what he, yeah, he never is. said anything uh, bad yeah. about And I would have been okay if he just came back with something. I'd rather him been wrong than be like, oh, well, I'm offended. And if he'd made a point, you're not black. Called, you can't say it. He was so yeah. close minded and got offended. If he'd even said something and been dead wrong, but you wouldn't have got offended. I think Ramos was better. actually making good points. I think he didn't say anything offensive. I, I like Vivek, man. Hey, yeah. If I'm to engage in a debate like that, and Vivek on the ballot, that's what I didn't see today. I don't know why. Well, I'm not saying the argument. That's just what I'm saying. different viewpoints. Yeah. All I had to say was like, how did it happen? And he explained how it happened. And then he just, well, uh, yeah, no, uh, we'll do some business vivid. As I'm saying, like, family, we can do I like you. Let me it say was so about it. Like I said at the beginning of the video, I like you a lot. He was so close. So I was point. uneducated. I'm educated. Because the, the, the whole premise of the existence of black people in America is that you are a victim, 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 victim. People are not willing to acknowledge that there were things that were done to assist blacks in to becoming what what we are today yes. and white people by and large are the ones that 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 facilitated a lot of this the yes. civil war was fought so that we could be free as well as other things and it wasn't until hundreds of thousands of white people died in the Civil War in order for us to even have an opportunity. Because if the Union didn't beat the Shut Confederacy, up. we'll still probably be enslaved. Shut up. But Union. good men, Shut up. and there was black people on that too, good men, majority mm -hmm. white, fought for our freedoms. And then we began to secure them over no, 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 time no, 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 no. in a much more meaningful yeah. way. But, but but see, Don them wants you to think that you ain't got no freedoms, this country is this. Man, Vivek Ramaswamy just literally destroyed CNN. And I hope every single person that's listening to this can digest the facts and then see that when the facts were told, the pundit could not accept it. And he had to pull the race card Goodness. and say, because you ain't black, you don't know what the facts yeah. are. You don't know what truth is. Was, you don't know what objective truth and reality is. And so, that, you know, I, I can go down the list. 
I'm glad you're here. Thank you. No, I'd rather have said something on his and team, get him on my, in touch with me. I want to interview him in yeah, front of everybody not, because I think this guy has a lot of talent and I will support him for president if Donald Trump just so happened to not uh, uh, get in this race. Yeah, and, and, and I'm not I'm complete the race. Just in case they so trick what? him and try to put him in jail. I'm All right. I'm rocking. I'm rocking. I'm I'm rocking. I'm for 2020. I wouldn't run I actually like I it. I actually cool. like it. You know, I just didn't know like who he was at the cool. beginning of the video. Yeah, like, like, like I thought he was one. Of the I candidates. think he's solid. You know, there's always those candidates that, that yeah, run every year and get knocked yeah, off in the first round. Yeah, I thought he yeah. might be one of them, but you know, I was so so wrong. He was Truth, yeah, real Truth big. Told, he, was he probably big. is gonna want to be on candidate get knocked out in the first round. I don't just think so, bro. Just because. Just, just well, be not. Let me see. He don't get past not the first round. Oh, he don't get past. He don't. He won't. He won't make it to past Trump. That's it's, what I'm saying. Oh, then look at his name. Just based off what he said. Just based off as he. Just based off as he. Oh yeah, he yeah. Himself. Yeah. He's a great candidate. Oh, he is a great candidate. I think he'll make it all the way up until the point where he got to go. I'm gonna have to hear his policies and whatnot. But just on how he articulated himself and spit them facts. Yeah. You got my attention. Yeah. I don't want to speak too soon. I need You got my attention. Yeah. He got my attention. I want to speak too soon. I will listen to what you have to say. Me too. And like, man, I will be. You know. Yeah. I gotta hear his voice on policies and health. Care things like that, yeah. taxes, but before I see you compare, but you sound good though. Okay, so y'all remember when Officer Taylor did say though that we need some real Americans in the office, right? Yeah, yeah. But he's an Indian he's American, American. born. He's though. American, bro. He just he's I mean, American born. Yeah. Just because he's na uh, yeah. yeah I mean, he's, like, he's the same as us. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You know, we're he like me. His, his dad came from another place, where he so yeah. His, he was born with American, American soil. Yeah. He's he an American yeah. man. Uh, American. Yeah. Yeah. He said it. He's American. He said, "I'm an American Indian." I'll but tell somebody that right in this country, don't y'all think that y'all would y'all would prefer someone to be more educated than? Uh, a true American. What do you mean? Like, okay, so someone, someone that's just said he's a so, businessman. Yeah. No, 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 him. No, I'm saying, I'm saying, he's very educated. I think that that's a better candidate than to run for somebody that's just a straight American. So, okay, boy, like, I went, I was just telling saying that we need someone to get someone a real American into office. Okay. All the presidents have been real American, so I'm trying to figure out what I mean, you, you have to be about. American or Yeah, you, oh, you, 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 you have to be American. Like born. somebody who really wanted like American value. He didn't, he didn't, you took it the wrong way. You not like American yeah. by blood. He meant like them by spirit. Yeah, Patriot. somebody that's you gonna put somebody that's America. gonna put America first. Yeah, yes. okay. like like you know we got Biden. He's I don't really feel like he's worried about other countries and they. Promise. Well, I'm thinking that I'm thinking he's America first. We put just somebody that loves America, a country boy in there. Just I know he didn't mean that. We need somebody who got America first attitude. Yeah, we need to be the number one country in the world. That's yeah. what we are. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. All right. All right. Well, this is a good video, man. Well, man. This might actually yeah. be on the top list of demolishing I've seen, though. Yeah, that was I've bad. Down even, down. The last black, <laughs> even the black guy had some good solid points with the professor with Candace. He had some cool. He just speaker. got John Jones. But he, At least even like with the Candace guy, like even though whether you agree with him or not, he still made an argument. Yeah, he, he didn't put a, yeah. oh, well, I, don't, I have to leave this I like how he kept That's his composure when bro tried to start attacking him, like, personally. He was like, listen, man, I'm just the facts like I don't understand like what's the problem he came facts 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 yeah facts. no opinion straight facts yeah and bro, it, bro, you want your ass what? broken boy well whatever ethnicity you are I said, I'll tell you what I am I'm American Indian that's what I'm saying I'm sorry guys I'm sorry guys I'm sorry guys it's the subculture trying to be insulted then follow up and insult somebody that wasn't cool like, yeah that wasn't that was, that was, that was terrible man. man yeah Vivek you seem cool bro hey if you don't win the first time run again my brother let us know what y'all think man we're out of here. 